you? How are we? I'm so happy that you're here, my darlings. Today's episode is what I eat in a day to maintain my weight. Are we? Oh, that's the door. Who could that be? Maria. Because Fumi Nation, they are so interested in the weight loss and the transformation, blah, yes. blah, blah. So I said, you know, I divided it. I did what I eat in a day to lose weight oh. and what we eat in a day to maintain the weight. the weight. Because it's completely different. How are you, my darling? How was you. Turkey? Turkey was beautiful. Ah! Yeah. Guess what, Christina? Look at her body. Look at her Hello, body. Hello, Fumi Nation. Look at How her body. I am so happy. I missed you. <laughs> did you buy me a present? I got you a present. I got what you more than a present. Because the thing is, I'm a piglet. <laughs> Importantly, the fupa. Look at I can't even go into this. It's gone. It's gone. The fupa has gone. I the saw fupa. that. I watched I, it in Turkey. Oh I hated God. it. You, but, but you know it was an yes. insecurity of mine. Yes. And unbelievable with the diet, with maintaining this, and with the ex that that hip exercise is a beast. It's a beast. I was doing it. I was doing it. I was doing it. I was doing it. In a fifties. And you know 55. what? 55, 55, 55 In April. About eight weeks. Check it out, Mama. 55, you're looking hot. 55 April. And living and loving. 55, 53. Yes. Yes. I am Never so, too late. Never too late. We're just starting. We're just starting. And we're going to have menopause exercise. Yes. Because I went to the GP, general practitioner. What did they say? Oh. Are you in the menopause? No. He said, said, what? The whole cooch is pink and plump. <laughs> he said, so, that, hold on. so that means. You can no. have another baby. He told me I have to put you on, on uh, birth control. <gasps> I was so ashamed. I tell oh you. Oh my god. Like, he said you're not and, and because I had Adrian so late. Uh -huh. That was yes. He said that was what I so it's kicked it back because I'm still having my cycle. So I, regularly you have your monthly. Hundred percent. Mine is two and a half years now. No 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 no. I have it every month. But oh. anyway, that's the next episode. Yeah, really? at last something that at least can because because he said I know I know it's a different episode <laughs> because he said that you will see the difference. Your waist will broaden. Uh -huh. You start to have one or two hairs, and it's true. Yes. And your skin dries the hormones. out. Yes. yes, and you will really visibly see the wrinkles. Yes. It will really kick in. And he said we've got maybe another eighteen months to two years. Oh my God! I sit, sit, sit. I'm gonna put so, your coat away. All right, we we'll put your coat away, and let us start with the episode. Oh my God! Um, uh, what do I usually say? Yes. Uh, for those of you that are stopping by for the very first time. <laughs> You are so very welcome indeed. My name is Fumi de Salovold and welcome to my humble abode. Welcome to my home. Welcome to my kitchen. And we are going to have today's episode, which we're going to talk about the food that I eat to maintain my weight loss. I have no intention of yo-yoing anymore and I had to be very realistic. Fumi, what do you really want to do with your life? You can't be going up and down. You are in your 50s and the 60s are coming and the 70s and i have girlfriends that are in their 70s their 60s their 80s their 90s i don't know whether i introduce you to chris chris is 93 and she's beyond and amazing so um i will let christina come in and then we'll sit at the table and we'll talk about food because as you can see she looks amazing doesn't she just i am so excited <laughs> Christina's here. I am so excited. I am so proud of you. I'm so proud Thank of your you. journey. You look amazing. Thank you. You look amazing. Fumi Nation has missed you. As you guys know, and you better be supporting her, Christina has her own YouTube channel. I do. And it is doing so, so very I well have indeed. 7,000 subscribers. Your Fumi Nation. They are a force to reckon with. No, Fumi Nation is no joke. 1,000, four weeks ago, I am at nearly 7,500. You hit 10. 
you will hit 10,000 in no time. Because I think Fumination, they are a completely different tribe. Yes. They are bigger and better than me. I've said it so many times. They are from everywhere. They are international. They are women loving women, women supporting women. Yes. They are women that have just been so amazing. And when I say this, it's all the way from, I even have teeny boppers. I have teenagers, yeah, I have teenagers, 12 year olds as well, pre-teens, all the way to 80 year olds. Because you know what? I had a 20 something year old the other day. Uh-huh. And she says she's from you. Yes. 21, 22. Yeah. yeah. She said I'm here from Fumi Nation. Yes, because a lot of them, you know, mother figure, sister figure, yeah. niece figure, auntie figure. And I am finding as I'm getting older, as we're getting older, that my 60 year olds are really my sisters oh. yes they are my sisters and they're so fine i've got 63 i've got 67 68 69 58 amazing. and they're so amazing 72 3 and it's uh, they have liberated me to make me feel very comfortable in my skin yes that age is truly just a number keep on living true because there are a lot of people like i mentioned before who just don't live they don't live, they strap themselves yeah. with, I'm too old. Yeah. And that's not the case. You are just getting started, honey, when I tell you. So, Christina, I am so happy that you are here for this particular episode because Thank I was you. talking to them about what I eat when I want to lose weight, of which I have. I don't want to lose anymore. You I like the way yes, you are. I love it. My full power has gone. <laughs> My flappy bat wings has gone. Mm. The back fat gone. Has gone. So I just want to maintain, and this is what I'm eating to maintain. And I know that you are maintaining I too. Am. So we have our breakfast, we have our lunch, we have our ding dings. Yes. So this is different, as in because I constantly work out. Why do I work out? Oh my God, it clears my head. Yeah. And I get so many ideas. Yes. To the point that it happens to me when I'm sleeping and when I'm working out, I have to have my phone to yeah. write down notes. I just have to, it clears my head and sometimes it's almost as if it's problem solving. Yeah. And then I sleep better at night. I do too. I remember when you said to me, remember back in the days when you used to walk me around the block? Yeah. When I could, out of breath, and yeah. you said, Christina, come on up the hill, let's go. Yeah. I've continued that because of my health. Yes. I walk. Yeah. You said, Christina, keep walking. No, it's so fantastic. And it's gentle walk. on your knees. Yes. Is gentle on your knees. I do a lot of exercises with the chairs yes. because I was plus size. Christina was plus size. Yes. It doesn't mean anything. No. And while we are on top of that, you're still beautiful. You're still sexy. Yeah. I'll make love to you a hundred percent with all the extra love to kiss and hug. I don't mind. I'm not that person. No. You understand me? As you clearly see, Ula has lost weight. Yes. I'm not that person. My, me, it's, it's your spirit, your soul. That doesn't change. True. Everything else is a shell yes. of which we'll get older and gray hair yes. and we will have the wrinkles and we will have the back and we will be in our 90s. Yes. But wouldn't it have been fun for the journey that we had? So don't worry about that. Mine is on the health. Yes. I want to be here. Yes. Because I was telling them my girlfriend came and she's 60, sorry, she's 58 and she came with her grandson who was three to play with Adrian. Aww. And I realized I'm a mother and a grandmother. You are. And I have to be here for Adrian. Yes. I have to be here for him. 25, 30 years. There you go. Yeah. Because we worked so hard yeah. for him to be a part of our family. So we have to be here and see him to the finish and line. Health. And but my health is the key yeah. to the vault yeah. of long, healthy life. Very true. That, yeah. that, that was what, it, when you asked me, what was that aha moment? Adrian. It was Adrian and Ula. And Ula. I don't want no other woman up in here kissing on him, talking about I'm dead, nah, nah. no, we're not doing, that. it happened to this woman, something Ooh. brown, what does she call I herself, never. do you, you know you who know I'm talking about, yes, that's exactly what happened to her, and he brought his girlfriend How in, sad. she had Alzheimer's that or something like that, it. yes, you covered that episode, okay, my greatest fear, you see, so yeah. that's why you will get your trigger, you will get your aha moment, yes. For to tell you, no, let me get my act together. All right, can I have a bottle of water? You can, yeah, indeed. Okay, there we so go. what do I have in the mornings? Pretty much the same. I have my oatmeal. I love my oatmeal. 
and I have it with an array of fruits. So as you can see here, I have my strawberries, my raspberries, I have my kiwi, I have apples, and then I have my bananas, which also doubles up as extra carbs for me because you want to have the good carbs. Because you need your good carbs, right? You need, you absolutely need your yeah. good carbs, my darling. So you have your blueberries, you have your raspberries, you have grapes, you have bananas. Then I will have with my low fat spray, I might have a nice omelet. I wasn't having that when I was trying to lose weight because I really wanted to keep it super clean. I have my boiled eggs, but I will have a delicious omelette and I will have whole wheat bread. Yes. I still love my pita bread and I also love my naan bread. I'm a woman of all cultures. I, I believe I'm from all over the world. So what I do is that I put it like so. I put in my eggs, yes. vegetables. vegetables. Oh, I live for that. Put my sauce and everything and home wrap it up in tissue if i gotta go I'm delicious take i take it with me and those are my red peppers those are the onions yes. that's my chicken or whatever i'll put that in i will even put my meatballs i saw you put hummus oh my god those are your good fats yes what was the one you did for me the other day avocado avocado is delicious yes. that's another good fat, fat. I'm not a specialist, but you have your good fats and you have your, you know, not so great fats. Yes. Now for snacks, my snacks, tortilla black chips. When I tell you they're the tastiest, they're tastier than the white tortillas. Indeed. Indeed. Yes. Huh? yes. Because I know you live in love. I love and love and guess what? I got a bag for you, mama. Yes, yes, yes. I bought two bags. Thank you. Of course. So this is for me to take That's home. That's for you to take Thank home, Thank you, honey. my sister. That's it. Then I have what? My sugar-free Coke. You see, I'm living my life. <laughs> You're living your best life. I'm living my Up best. Up in the streets. Up in the streets, mama. I have my coke. You want to have a snack or whatever, not a problem with some ice, throw that up in there. So you're I, not depriving yourself. That's the point. You have to make better choices, yes. you know, so that that way I'm still my size four. Yes. You know, I'm still my size but four. But you're smaller than a four though. It's because of the, of the, the muscle. Last time it's I the toning. You. It's the toning because shoulders. the lifting, the shoulders are a beast. Shouldering. I've never had shoulders like this in my waking oh. life. Not even when I was modeling. Not even when I was modeling because that weight training is an education yes. all on its own. And you know, the weight training is essential for when you're in your 50s. Mm -hmm. Some of you will tell me, Fumi, please, what are you talking about? You should start it even before your 50s. You're right. But I am educating myself yes. now because I lost 40 pounds. Remember? I remember. All oh, right. Yes. I gained it back. I never lifted weights. I was doing too much cardio walking and cardio treadmill. and walking and treadmill. I remember. And instead of me building the muscle, as I am getting older, my muscle is depleting. Mm -hmm. So we have to pump it up, pump up to the volume, pump up the volume, pump up the volume. And actually, the weights is replacing what you're losing. Right. But it's not a bad thing, actually. It's a very good thing. Okay. That's why you have to throw the skill away. Educan taught me. She said, for me, that's not the skill you need, mama. You need a skill that shows you losing fat. Oh. I said, say what now? She Educan is a beast. I live for her. She lives for her too. Yes, I do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We do our <laughs> workouts together. We do our workouts together. Yes. Yep, yep, yep. And she said, get a skill that shows you everything. I never knew. I never knew. I need to get one of those skills now. Oh, I'll get you one. Don't Thank worry. You. As, as a you. gift. Thank you. Yeah. Mother, I, you. I live for you. I do. <laughs> Christmas. Hot mess. Hot mess. Oh my God. So yeah, I still have my water. Sometimes I'll dilute my Coke with water. Yeah. Sometimes I'll have an orange juice. I don't smoke. I don't drink. It's not my thing. It's not personal to anybody. That's just me personally. But I feel that it has added to my health yeah. as well as sleeping and minding my business. The second you come to me with some kind of gossip, like, oh, did you see what I am out? You're out. You're walking. Please. You're gone. I wish God. I, no, I, <laughs> I want to. We're gone. We're gone. Because you know what? It's not my business. It doesn't pay my bills. No. It's aging me. And it's taking me away from my family and friends. Thank you. It's a gossip. And on top of which, I don't know if it's true. True. You're right. They gossip about me too, you know. Oh wow, they gossip about all of us. Yes, I gossip about all of us. Exactly. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. So yeah, sardines also fabulous, fabulous, fat, right? Fantastic fats. 
My lunch is salads. I tell you why. I'm not gonna I eat. Yeah, not so bad to you. That's coming, not right? So, yes, it's in coming. In the supermarket. It's coming in the supermarkets. I'm and that was that. catered to Ula. Mm. Ula is the love of my life. And, you know, we were just talking about our husbands, mm. how really, truly fortunate that we are. And I made that not so bad to you because when I w w lost the weight, Ula also went on the diet with me. I and he threw every And he, one day he said for me, I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm telling you, he was so hungry. He said, when does it end? He's okay, I'm so hungry. <laughs> hungry. And I said, oh, so I made the nuts because nuts too are very good. Yes. Monosaturates, they're very, very good. Those are good fats. Mm -hmm. And so you could have the nuts with the salad. I like salads in the afternoons. I like eating light in the afternoons because my beautiful African food, if I eat pounded yam, if I eat eba, I want to sleep. Yes. It will because why the tummy is churning and it's doing extra work and you sleep you I can't sleep I gotta work yeah so I find that when I eat light in the afternoon then I'm good to go and I can keep up the momentum mm. still awake and really oh fresh and I like that my tummy is not puffed out it's I eat lighter, right? much lighter and I, I like to poop I, like that too. I get nervous when I've not pooped in two days you know, I was away for a week. I didn't know. No. Until I came back. Every no. time I go to a foreign country, it's a no. Oh, no, no, no. The, the body shut down. It's like, I don't trust this place. As soon as I step <laughs> up, I hit the toilet. I was like, oh, you're pissing. Who is that? Maria. Yeah. Come oh. say hi, baby. <laughs> How are you, honey? Maria is our nanny. <laughs> oh, she's a part of the family at this point. I just love Maria. You know, how are you? Come and say hello to Fumi Nation. You see, she's part of the family. Look at her with her Norwegian sweatshirt. And Ula is from Norway. Do you see? Have you been? You go to Oslo? No. I take you. I, I take you to Oslo, you take me to Brazil. Okay, Rio de Janeiro. Alala, alala. Guess what? I got my rice and I do the best fried rice up here in these streets. Yeah. Put in your spring onions. Cha -cha 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 -cha. Put in your garlic. Where's the garlic? It's here somewhere on this table. And then I put in um, a little bit of my spray oil. I yes. always do that. Because of you, I got this now. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Chop up your red peppers and then toss it in there. It begins to sizzle. Put in your egg, beat it, put in your egg, and put in your rice. And then you just cup it out, and you have that with your salad, you have that with any and every vegetable. Go right ahead and treat yourself. I have rice because I am a Gambian. My mother is Gambian, a big Gambian girl. I have to have me rice. <laughs> I have to have my rice. So That's I have my rice. Food in Liberia, well, right? really rice. And I have my corn, and which I mix into my salad. I add more stuff onto my salad uh -huh. so that it's really hefty yes. and it's nice. And I, of course, I love my spices. I also buy bits of chicken pieces. Because if you buy a whole chicken, I find that it might go to waste. Mm. So I buy chicken pieces to throw into my salad. Again, you gotta have the sweet potato. Yes. The sweet because because you need your carbs. Because I will never ever 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 from here on in stop lifting weights because I want those sexy long lean legs. Yes. I'm even looking into Pilates. I'm just in this zone where you know I don't mind and I live. So you think is that with our hair with yes. healthy hair studio? Yes. By the way, you know, it's yeah, fabulous. and it's as thick as a blanket. Thick as a blanket. I live, it's already grown. Yes, yes. I know, I know, I know. I have my hot chocolate. Yes. I have my hot chocolate in the evening. Sometimes I have a tea, but I'll also treat myself That's and a have treat. Yes. Actually. I treat myself in a place of chocolate. Yes. I don't really crave it anymore and I don't want to. Because it takes about two, three weeks mm -hmm. for your old self to shed and then for your new self yes. to be reborn. I'm not really crazy about sweet chocolates or whatever. I c I'm really happy to do without it. And to be honest, I like myself this way. Yes. So I'm not trying to gain. Having said that, am I a party pooper? No. I will have a slice of cake in mm. to, to celebrate. You know, I'll go out, I'll have my fun. But this is the way I want to live my life. And I like my proportions. Talking about proportions, I also buy these healthy pods where you've got beetroot. 
you've got you've got your greens and then you've got your rice you've got your cauliflower i go to all of these healthy food uh, stores and i know some of them is not all the way healthy but like i said i work out every day christina works out every day yeah. I, if I'm doing weights, I'm lifting my arms or I'm doing my core or I'm doing my legs. I enjoy it. That's my me time. And then I do 30 minutes cardio and I don't do anything and else. And that's it. And that's it. Yeah. But you brush your teeth every day. Yes. You wash your face every day. Yes. So why don't you exercise some form every, every day? day? Yeah, you're right. You see, because you see, I work from home. So sometimes I don't get to go out. Or when I do want to go out, it started raining. Yeah. Or I have to go pick up Adrian, Adrian. from school. My time is limited. Yeah. So sometimes I don't. So I like to exercise. Move the body. Move the body. Move the body. I love my snacks. Oh, I love these. These are biscuits. These are animal zoo laban biscuits. And I'm ashamed. No, not ashamed. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> they were actually bought for Adrian. And so I ate one. And that was and the that beginning was of the end. And I live and I love, love them. I also love these. Christina bought yes. this for me. That was how I, I love them. Them. I very like sweet and salty popcorn. That's another thing. You can have your sweet and salty popcorn. I don't have it here, but I also like jelly beans. Yes. Why? Because I can take one or two. And, and, it, and you're satisfied. And I'm satisfied. Because you see, you don't eat for the sake of you're just stuffing your face. And that's what I did. I wasn't even hungry. And I was eating. And you was eating. Yeah. I didn't like that about myself. Yeah. So just take a little and that's it. You're good. Keep it pushing. That way you're not craving. That way you're not craving because yeah. it's not sustainable. Very it's true. not realistic. Yeah. Christina, would you like to say something, darling? So off the back of what Fumi said, everything she said, she's taught me and I'm now in turn teaching myself. Same thing, I have my snacks every saturday as a matter of fact so you have your snacks once a week once a week i like that once a week and that could be a piece of cake it could be a packet of crisps so not the healthy ones like the walkers cheese and onions yes salt and vinegar yeah i have my brownies yes because i've got a very sweet tooth yes and i'm not ashamed to say it no but i have that treat and i'm satisfied 100 percent. i drink lots of water you live for the water, I do, you, for do, the water. do you drink juice Every now and again, the one you gave me, elderflower. Yes. I delicious. put that in the water oh. and I'm good to go. Yeah. And that's it. Yeah. I have my rice. I have even the pasta. Because yes. you said to me, Christina, do not. Dip. That's what I was doing, guys. I will starve myself. No, don't do that. And then at the end of the, the day, yes. I overeat. Of course. Overeat. Compensating. And then feel bad afterwards. Yes. I don't do that anymore. I think I feel like eating, but in moderation. Yeah. And I'm good. Yeah. So thank you, sis. No, you're so very thank welcome. You. You're so, so very I'm welcome. Living for you're it. so very welcome. Like she said, you can have your pasta. Again, you boil your pasta, throw in the broccoli, throw in all of the vegetables. It's so delicious. Yes. It is so chops of bits of chicken, bits of sausage. Throw in, have the side. Always try to have some kind of colored food. Yes. If your food is all beige and all white, it's not healthy enough. You taught me that. It's Even not. with the porridge, Christina put strawberries in there, blueberries in there, kiwi in there, pineapple in there. And that's... 100%. And it will fill you yes. up. And because it's a carbohydrate, it releases ever so slowly, mm -hmm. which makes you full for longer. longer. Because right. the sugar is empty calories. Yes. It will bust and blow. Yes. Talking about that, I have my strawberry jam and I spread that on my pita bread. That is my sugar. That's my treat because I have a sweet tooth. It's just something that it is what it is. So I have that on my bread. Everything again is in moderation. Yes. I think that this time around, when I really went on this health journey, because it's not about the losing weight. No. It, that, that was not where I was coming from this time. I just saw my friend and her grandson, and I said, Fumi, you've got to change the way you eat mm. because you have people that love you. Yeah. And they want you to be here the longest. And my parents are still here. They're in their 80s. Yes. And they look like they're in their 50s. Because my father, a doctor, a surgeon, has always eaten healthy his entire life and so with my mom yeah. and always exercised you saw them here running around yes. they don't have walking stick they don't have wheelchairs no. nothing this one they're just walking around yeah. it's very odd actually because <laughs> I, i'm like daddy where are you going he said oh, i'm just going down to bobby even says yes. you for me let me fix the 
food for you. Yes, let me fix the food. I'll do the food. I'll do the, this thing or whatever. Then we'll go for rest. a walk. Yeah, I'll go and pick up Adrian yes. and then we'll go to the park. Healthy living. Healthy living is key. Mm -hmm. It's key. We eat too much. Yes. We eat too much. We don't over need it. Eat. We overeat. Yeah. I overeat. I overeat. I overeat. I love my plantains. I will never mm -hmm. get rid of them. But what I do, I steam them. Yes. I will grill them. The I'll put them in the oven. The sweet potato the other day. Perfect. There you have it. Yeah. I live for it. My sweet potato. And you did it with minced meat. That was beautiful. Fantastic. So those are your options. So you have again carb because you're thinking the salad is not enough. Mm. You put your sweet potatoes, you put your bananas, you put your plantain, you steam it. You can even have your brown rice. You can even make fried rice. And that is with 1%, is this, yes, yes. one calorie, one calorie of oil. Just psh, spray it in there yes. and then add all of your spices is copacetic. Ula introduced me to this. Delicious. I'm gonna taste this one. I'm gonna taste Woo! This I Christina, delicious. I said, Ula, where did you get this from? And he's got to me the Thai pack. Oh. The Thai pack is somewhere. I don't know where he put it. Christina, Christina, do you know I even eat it with okra? Oh. I saw okra the other day in the supermarket. My eyes nearly jumped out of my head. <laughs> okra in the supermarket. I, I promise you, downtown. I of course, market. always downtown. Yeah. But I was there. And yes, it was fabulous. I ate it to the point that I said, for me, put the fork down. <laughs> put the fork down. Put the fork down, sis. I know, I know. Okra. Okra, it was delicious. And I chopped up chicken. I chopped up fish. I put crab also into it. I got crab. I got lobster. Do you want us to have eating episodes? Yes, that would be good. That would be fast. Bring the lobster and we sit down and have mukbang. Mm -hmm. Let us know down in the comments. What do you think, my darlings? So that is it, my loves. This is what we eat in a day to maintain. I, to maintain our weight. And I am loving it. Thank you so very, very, very much for coming into my life. Because it was a bit of a vlog. And we have fabulous Christina. Please follow her on her YouTube channel. Yes, guys. We are going to come together and do so many episodes yeah. you don't even because know. Because they keep asking. They want the episode, how we became friends. How we became... Oh, you're going to love it. Yes. You're going to love it. You are going to love that story. So we have story time. Yes. That would be a nice story time because they love story they time. Do. We want sister to sister. We yes. want story time. You're going to have everything. I give you everything. everything. We'll even have skincare, makeup, hair, everything. Because we are women. Yes. That's us. And that's you. And that's me. And that's all of us together. So from Christina and I, thank you so very much, my darlings. Do not forget to subscribe to our channels. Hit the notification. Hit the notification button, my darlings. And we will see you what? Sooner than later. Bye. <laughs> Christina, I live for you. I live for you. I do live for you. I miss you. I'm too much. I miss you. Where have you been? Turkey. Don't you dare. Because because the week before I didn't see you. Because I was busy. Yeah. So yeah. You yeah. put me onto this YouTube. It's yeah. hard work. Hard work. Maximum respect. All right. Hello guys, we're just messing around. Ula has lost 20 pounds. Yes, he was also inspired. <laughs> Maria is the only skinny one right here. <laughs> you know what? You can live your best life. Yes. You really can. You can be out here doing all kinds of you know, fabulous things. Uh, Ula, come on, swing your hips, baby. Just try. <laughs>